What's up everybody, Gaming Gargoyle here, and welcome back to No Place Like Home, Season 5, Episode 9. Hope everyone is doing good, hope everyone's doing fine. Uh, as we saw in the last episode there, we were able to uh, go see our Irish friend, uh, Frank. And uh, we got our house opened up, so let's just go through here quick. Give a little bit of a clean, 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 so we can see what we get to work with. That's all in here. Oh, oh, there's another room in here. Oh, and a chest. Did we get a recipe? Ooh, but we got a classic furniture set. Nice. They're really going for the de decoratives in this one so far, so... I like it. And there we go. We now have a cleaned up house. Speaking of cleaning up, we should probably go check on all our, 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 our town's folks and see what type of upgrades we can get ourselves into. So, I've gone through, I did plant the blueberries, the corn, and the oranges in between episodes. Um, I'll show you what the, where, what and where I put the uh, orange orchard. I uh, haven't played today, so uh, the game's a little slow in loading up. So we'll come over here, ooh, wow, we got a whole bunch of wallpapers out of that too. Hold on. I didn't notice that. That's just, uh, get rid of those extra rays. I've added a couple extra chests to the um, the storage areas here, as you can see. There we go. Get rid of all this stuff. I've gone and upgraded uh, this super recycler and this preserving to a super preserving. So I now have uh, two of each. I'm so happy now that we just can uh, place the upgrade on top and it upgrades the machine in place. Love it, love it, love it. Uh, let's go see Rudy first. Rudy, Rudy. Can I help you with anything, Alan? I'd like to shop, Rudy. All right, let's see here. Ah, drill upgrade, glass waste, 500 preserves. Yeah, we can do that. Uh, thanks, Rudy. Oh, I hate it that it kicks us out every time. Uh, let's go over here. Nope, can't do that. We don't have milk. Oh, but we can do berry picker gloves. All right, number two. Can't do that for a while. Ah, we can do this one, hardened drill. Get more damage out of our drill. Nice. And moving on. Nope, can't do that one. Can't do that one, onions. Ah, we can do this one, trash extractor too. So we'll get to a higher chance of getting double drops from our trash piles. Uh, let's see what's number three on that one. Garlic, can't do that one yet. Can't do cheese, can't do beets, can't do beets, can't do olives, and can't do cheese. All right, so thank you very much, Rudy. You're amazing. Thank you, my friend. Now we'll go for a quick little uh, jaunt over to Mark. I love this auto run feature. Just got to reach down and just hold the shift every once in a while. It's, gore it's awesome. Thank you, devs. Thank you. Thank you. Huge quality of life increase. At least for me, anyway. <laughs> can't speak for other people, but I will speak for myself when I say I like this auto run feature. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, as always, thank you so very much to all the newest subscribers to the channel. Thank you for your likes. Thank you for your comments. And uh, definitely um, enjoy the series. We have lots in there. Check out the homepage. Check out the description down below for a bunch of informations. Cool. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, we can get the, the super duper recycler. Uh, sorry. Ultra Recycler for uh, some corn, some preserves. Ooh, we can get the Ultra Perversing, uh, that Perversion? Uh, ultimate Preserving Machine. <laughs> perversion Machine? Oh, look out, that party just took a whole new turn. Okay. <laughs> uh, oh, wheat, we have oats, but we don't have wheat. Okay. And milk? Nope. Sure, let's just buy this dirt and get it over and done with. There we go. Now, I think that was everything for him, correct? Can't do the wheat. Can't do the milk. Alright. Thank you so much there, Mark. You have yourself a good day. Bye, Ellen. You'll be taking care of yourself now. Running all the way over here to go see our Frenchman, Harold. Oh, hello. How are you today? Come on over here and buy some Steve's. I have lots of Steve's to buy. 
Up for some more piggy business. Yep, in the shop. Thank you. And, oh, piggy business level two. Upgrade for two corns. We can do that. Woohoo! We got the pigsty upgrade. And what else we got? Uh, uh, nope, can't do that. Oh, we can do the beehive. We can go ultra beehive for three corn. Thank you. And what else we can get? Uh, let's see here. Can we get the... Yep, yeah, we can do the ultra mayo. Nice. Give me those upgrades. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Uh, let's see what else we got here. To do, to do, to do. Uh, let's see. Ooh, jam maker. Yep, we want that. Uh, if you're ever in a jam, get yourself a jam maker. And I think that's probably going to be everything for this uh, gentleman. It was uh, Fra uh, for Harold? Onion. And onion. Or no, oh, yeah, onion and onion. Okay, we can't do either or. And beets. All right. Woohoo! We did it! We got ourselves upgraded as far as we can with everything that we've been able to pick out of the Lonely Hills. Let's get this guy, uh, oh, uh, let's give this guy home. There we go. We now have a fox. Oh, wow. Look at how this place really got cleaned up. I like this. This is nice. This is cool. I wonder if Bellin's going to get married there. Just saying. It's awfully picturesque. So I can't remember if there was five foxes or three foxes. We shall find out. So that's one, two. Oh, look at that. These guys all have seeds. Sweet. Why not? Might as well take them. I forgot that we had gotten the, the foxes done already. Excellent. Well, strawberry seeds are something that uh, I will not say no to. Oh, just too far out of my range. Too far out of my range. There we go. Okay, with that being said, time to get back to Lonely Hills. We got to go see Rudy and hand in the bulbulator. Rudy! Rudy! Rudy, I got the bulbulator! Oh, Ellen. I knew I could count on you. So now, let's see. Hmm. 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 Oh, no. What happened? Your grandpa's calculations were correct. This man's brain was amazing. But I really hoped we could work around this problem and avoid this confrontation. Avoid what exactly? Let's say we need another part. From a man. A man from whom I borrowed some things. It doesn't matter what things. It matters that I did, and he's not exactly, you know, happy about that. You see, it's that I can't just go to him and ask him to give me the required part. So maybe you can do that for me. I guess I have no choice, right? So who am I looking for? The farmer, Harold Abbott. He's... No, oh, Mr. Abbott, of course, I know him. I've helped him already. Okay, that's good. We'll need his farmer's chain, Ellen. Get back to me as soon as you get the part. And we'll get the bulbulator going. All right, so roguelike Rudy now needs a part that Harold has. The issue is the farmer doesn't particularly like Rudy, so I have to get the part myself. It's a shame. People don't see Rudy for who he really is. But I guess it can't be helped. Get the last bulbulator part. Alright, so. Harold! Harold! Oh, well, hold on, Harold. Hold on. I forgot something over here. Can't forget the cases. Oops, how did I miss that one? I must have completely overlooked it. Alright, let's do it. Oh, for some more piggy business. Helen, help! I cannot believe it! I can't believe it! They're all gone! Uh, what happened? Who's gone? What? Who's gone? What? Where? 
My ducks are all gone. It's as if the entire heavens decided to spite me. I am not sure if I can take care of them. And, uh, please, will you help me? Will you take care of them? Um, to be honest, I came to you for a Bulby later part. No, please, the dogs might be in danger. We will talk about Bobby later, later. Okay. Uh, don't worry, I'll find your ducks. All right, so Harold, Harold the farmer needs me to find his ducks and keep them safe. Find and find and befriend five ducks. Doesn't that mean I need to build a duck house? I think I gotta build a duck house. And I think these things need... Uh, carrots, if I remember right? Yeah. All right. Okay. Hold on. Hmm. Well, that being the case, tell you what, I'm going to go through here and this area needs cleaning big time. That area needs a big, big clean. Now going to the exact opposite side of this area. Oop, there's one duckle. There's two duckles, three ducks in this area. But I have no uh, carrots. Let's see. Yep, there's another another duck here. Wow, we got lots and lots and lots to do here. That deer just ran right through that building. Good on you. So, this one was a little tricky to grab. There we go. So I came into here. And, uh, yeah. There's a lot of garbage here, too. So I'm guessing this is an extension. This is the old area, just, uh, redone. Alright, let's get you cleaned up here. Oh, excuse me, dear. So yeah, there's, there's a ton of stuff in here. Let's see, is there any more? Come on. Ding, 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 ding. Let me through. Just want to pass. I want to see if there's another ex 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 exit through here. And see what we got here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mummy, 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 mummy. Oh. Uh. Ow, ow. <laughs> okay, it was a trap. <laughs> Came through the door and I was getting beat on. Okay. Um. You, knock it off. Both of you, stop. Thank you. Okay. So, yeah, and it looks like we do have that other large area in here where the tent and that used to be. So, I will go through, get all these three areas cleaned up. I will uh, go with you. Actually, hold on. Let's do this. Let's go save and go home. Let's build a duck farm together. Let's get the ducks done. Oh, the loadings. Takes forever. It is a nice little um, screen to see, though. I love this watercolor art. I'm trying to get my kiddo into painting and stuff like that, too, so... That's probably why I have an extra appreciation for it, because I've been looking at a lot of that stuff lately. Uh, let's go over here. Not sure we need that. Uh, I was told to make sure I have these on me um, uh, for the deer. don't know why, but I was told to have oranges and paprikas. Like, okay. Thank you for your comments. Uh, right, duck house. Ducks, ducks. Goose, duck, duck, goose. Uh, duck. Alright. So I do not want to mix my ducks and my geese together. They shall stay separate. I don't want any genetic uh, malfunctions going on. Alright, so there we go. We now have that. And I need five corn. So it's going to take me, uh, or five. I don't know why that works like that. It does sometimes. Um, yeah, I'm going to need five carrots to befriend the five ducks. And I won't befriend them. I won't, I'll try not to grab anything. All I'm going to do is I'm going to go through there, clean that all up, and then we can run through all the areas and try to get this uh, duck quest done together. So, I'll be back after, boo, quite a bit of time, my time, but just this quick little blink for you. Well, I was 99% done when this big old baddie over here decided that uh, it was going to mess with my plan. I was trying to clean up all the trash around it, but uh, it kept spitting on me, and finally, 
It got me. So, yeah, I decided to bring you all in for this part. So for me, I just do this. <laughs> Oop. I just use the water. Make it simple and easy. Now, it's unfortunate that we released the duck. Yeah, we were rewarded with the suitcase. Sweet. Oliver salad ingredients. Mayo, corn, and tomato. Cool, cool, cool. Is there something under here? No. Hey, bottle. Come here. Alright, so we got one there. We got a bunch of ducks. So I want to clear out the ducks that are in Harold's area first. And if there's not five ducks there, then we'll move on. Okay, that was that for there. Yep. Bunch of deer running around and all that, so... Sweet! Here is another crate. We haven't had to use them in a while. But we now have two on our persons. Here's another suitcase over in here. Gave us two different types of hats. There was nothing in here. We grab that. This is where there was some wood somewhere or something. Did we grab that already? We must have. I don't know. Okay, so we'll go from here into Harold's area and let's go get ourselves some ducks. We already got the uh, the coop at the house, so this should be pretty fairly straightforward. Have a carrot. And we'll be friended. There's this one that was over here. Have a carrot. All right. Number three. And there should be two more over here. And there's actually a lot of ducks in here. I like it. There we go. One more. And uh, I think that's all we need. It was five. All right, quest complete. Return to Frank. We will return to Frank as soon as... Oh, look at that. Another duck. <laughs> They're all over the place. So, yeah, if you wanted to, you could probably easily increase your coop up to 10 to a second level. This is the place right here. Oh, this place is huge. Okay, so there is some wood here. And then there's this here. This is the deer hunt. And I'm not sure if Frank wants us to do it as a quest or not, so I'm not going to build it until uh, after we talk to Frank or Harold here. So I just want to grab all the goodies. So we got a Zen garden. Some rubble. I remember there was something over here. Yep, some more wood. Nothing down there. It's just really hard to keep track. The big area. Okay. Oh, how did I miss that? How did I miss a giant piece of trash? Alright. Another suitcase. Another piece of wood. Okay, let me just go over back over here again. Just triple check everything because there's little nooks and crannies up along the side walls there. Don't want to miss out on those. So let's just grab the entire lower area. Oh, it doesn't tell me what we get anymore in the bottom left-hand corner. I really like that. I appreciated knowing what it was that I collected. Nope. I was thinking that was feather for a second. Nope, we want that. That's more wood. There was something in here, wasn't there? Yep. Okay, 
Hey, did I get everything? Yep, got that, got that, got that. Look at all these ducks down here. Like, yeah, you can definitely have a full, probably 15 in the end. If you look around everywhere, you might find 15 ducks. That'd be awesome. Have a full coop. Maybe we'll do that near before the end of the uh, the series here, season five. We'll see if we can collect as many of the uh, the animals of each that we can, the pigs, the cows, the you know, etc., etc., etc. All right, nothing here. There's some sneaky, sneaky places. You got to keep your eyes out. Like some are really well hidden inside bushes, like this one. Ugh, and it's a pain in the butt to get into. There we go. Ooh. Getting out's easy. Getting into it, pain in the butt. Alright, so that's a feather. Here are the pigs. Do you have any oats, brother? I am quite famished. Sorry, brother, I already begun eating the oats. I have very few oats, brother. I must procure yours. Sorry, brother, but you mind I have no moats. That's it. You have disgraced me for the last time. I was there for you when you were just a baby. And this is the treatment you give me. I'll tell you a secret, brother. Mm -mm. I'll tell you. Uh, the heck with it. I'm just going to do this regularly. Bounce some back and forth between two characters that I don't do regularly is next to impossible. I'm just going to read it out normally. I'll tell you a secret, brother. I'm a member of an organization called the Order of the Dark Oats. But there is a price to pay. You can't tell anyone else about this organization. Not even your closest friends. Uh, brother, I I'm getting weaker by the second. Just tell me how to get the oats. Quest. Perhaps I can get some oats for these weird pigs. Okay, so we got to bring oats to strange pigs. We have oats at the farm, but we used to have to pick them up from Harold. So I don't know if we use our own oats or not, so we'll find out soon enough. So I met these strange pigs. It felt like they were talking, talking about oats in a strange manner. I must say, this sparked my curiosity. I'll bring them oats and see what happens next. Ta-da! So that's done. Oh, two case. A new recipe for carrots, tomatoes, and peppers. You get veggie juice. Hey, sounds like a V3. Uh, da, 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 da. All right, let's go back to Harold. Hand in our ducks. Hello, Harold. I have befriended and homed five of your ducks. What would you like? You are a gem, Ellen. Thank you for your kindness. I don't know why you're friends with Rude, but I bet we cannot complain about others in these unstable times, can't we? Uh, about that. I know, you heard. You're trying to rebuild the bubble later, and I assume you need my neutralizer. I'll gladly give it to you, seeing how much you help me, but I can't. I need it right now, and I'll be needing it for the foreseeable future. Unless... Unless... Unless you're able to help with the deer population that's settled around here. Napoleon used to love playing with them, and he would be so happy if he could do it again. But they are now scattered, running around scared. They can't play around without the basic needs met. You need to help them. Yes, do that, and the part will be yours. Okay, so new quest, the Whitlet. Before giving me the part for a bubby later, Harold requested that I first take care of the deer population present in Lonely Hills. Helpful, helping animals is always very important for me, so I'll get to work at once. All right, let's go help five deer. So in order to help the five deer, I think we got to build their place up first. So in order to help them, we have to build this up. And the timer's not that bad, so I appreciate it. Now, I remember a time when you had to befriend the deer by giving them, uh, I can't remember what it was, acorns? And I think I have acorns on me, so I think we should be okay. So this is what the peppers and the oranges were for, for the deer. Okay. Thank you so very much to that one particular other content creator who made mention of that in the Discord. <laughs> I'm looking at you, honeysuckle. <laughs> Oh, there's more. Five wood. Well, we have five wood. Well, that's a weird perspective of the circle, but all right. Ta -da. All right, now we can talk to this thing again. And it wants one. All right, it took our acorn. Sweet. Hey, dear. Here. You're going to love my nuts. Here, have some. Okay, was there any more in here? Negatory. Let's go over to the other side. There should be at least another two over here. There 
There's one. There's two. Aha, and there's even a turd. Right for right me. There we go. Quest complete. Return to Frank. I realized I was going to go see Harold. Whoops. Harold! <laughs> Here. I'll just keep giving... Keep giving deers acorns so that way they're they're happy. They have all their friends. And I don't have to listen to them burping in my ear in this area every time I come in, right? Alright. Harold! Hello, Mr. Harold. The deer are safe and happy now. Thank you, Alan. I knew I could rely on you. You're proving yourself time and time again, so here's something for you. Now you'll be able to prepare the bubble letter. Good luck, and please try not to rake any more havoc on this machine, okay? Please. What do you mean? So you don't know? Well, maybe that's for the better. Go, oh, kid. Fix those toxic clouds. Uh, what are you getting me into here, Harold? You're scaring me, man. You're scaring me. You are not a very friendly person at all. All right. Uh. Okay. We gotta go see Rudy. Rudy, buddy pal. Amazing, Ellen. Now we can get rid of this toxic hole. Just go down there and place the bobby later in the hole. It should remove the fumes right away. All right, Roguelite, the great bombulator is ready. Place the bombulator in the hall. It's finally done. Now I only have to place it in that huge hole in the Lonely Hills and hope it works. Come with me, ladies and gentlemen. Come with me. Follow me to the pit of despair and doom. Oh, I was going to do a Star Wars reference. What the heck is that thing called? A Narlax or something like that? That, uh, that uh, Jabba the Hutt keeps under his uh, graded flooring? I can't remember. But here it is, folks. The adventure awaits us. Now, if I remember right, you can only get down here once. Oops. I should have grabbed those ducks with it then or something weird. I remember there was something about ducks being down here. Oh, they're on those creatures' backs. That's what it is. All right. So you just lock one in. Bring it towards you. Swing. Bada, 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 swing. Same with these two. Get close. Run away. There we go. Hello. Run. Just get them constantly moving around. You get constantly moving around. Alright. Now that that one's gone... I use the water to get rid of these guys. Paralyze the health guy. Or kill him. Now what sucks is that if we can't ever come back. We can't. Uh, did I just use the air hose to kill those little guys? Whoa, whoa, wait. We've got to test something out here. I've never tried that before. I've using the vacuum. Oh, whoops. Oops. Hey, 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 hey. Alright. Can we use the vacuum? Oh, well, that is so much nicer. Okay. Oh, look at this. Two chests. Or suitcases. Ooh. And we're still getting those blue books here. Okay. Um, but yeah, so the ignore those two blue books on the bottom. Oh, it would be so nice. Oh, if we can't come back, we can't get those ducks later on. We might not be able to have a full 15 in a coop. That would suck. All right. And then you place your bulbulator down. It says place the bulbulator in the hole. We did that. All right, so three, give it a rotate. That's what I do anyway. That's what I. Hmm. So yes, in previous versions that I remember, once you came down here, did this, you couldn't go back down again. And so, yeah, you'd have to grab those ducks before or have space in your coop before you leave. Well, let's see if it's still the same case. Um, well, we might be able to get down there now. Might not be if we leave and come back again. Alright, let's go see what Rudy has to say. Rudy! Where are you, pal? See, and there's lots of pigs and other animals. Uh, so yeah, the chickens, the ducks, the pigs. Let's see how many we can get. 
It worked. We managed to create the great pulpulator and clean up the fumes. This is amazing, Ellen. Now they'll finally see that it can be valuable and helpful. Uh, what do you mean, Rudy? Well, not everyone was as patient with my experiments and innovations as your grandfather. So many people got angry, called me a thief. They didn't know I was just trying to come up with something to help them and this land. You've met a couple of them by now, right? They've all given up on bringing Earth back, cleaning it up, or just doing anything. All they do is wallow in their memories, their past, dreams of former glory. But your grandfather always pushed me to keep trying, and so I did. Oh, how proud he would have been if he could see us right now. Now go to Frozen Peaks, Ellen, and find Max. I can't wait to meet him again. Alright, we are supposed to now go to Frozen Peaks! Woohoo! We did it. Now, in order to go to Frozen Peaks... Uh, hold on, what's going to be the easiest way? This way. So, Frozen Peaks is located in uh, the village area. So, a funny thing happened on the way to the village. Look who's got himself a new home! Rudy! Rudy! Look at you, man! You're styling! Look at you! Cha-cha-cha-cha-cha! Gee! Sir, this is amazing! Look at you! I hope that makes a good screening. Uh, so yeah, look at that! Look at that! Rudy has his own place now, in the village. We've got that finished up, but we were heading towards Frozen Peaks, showing you the entrance. Let's just, uh... Oop, wrong way. There we go. Ah. There's Frank's fishing hut. So, let's see. We got Rudy, we got Harold, we got Frank. We need to get Mark. But here it is. And it's actually, you see how those pieces down there? Oh, we have nine of them. Okay, what I'm going to do is, this is Frozen Peaks. But it's going to have to wait until next episode. What I'm going to do with you folks, though, before we end today's episode, we're going to go save, go home. And I'm going to show you the purpose of these llamas. Okay? So, I think that in the game so far, through all the versions that I've played, that glass has been the hardest or, or the, the least amount in resource. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to come through here. I'm going to pick all these up. And then I'm going to set the machine to glass. Uh, machine, er, uh, building? Come on. There it is. So, take that out. Put that in. Now I'm going to tell them to collect that. So, between this episode and next episode, I'm probably going to... Upgrade our jam maker to level two, these to level three, and these to level three as well, because I'm pretty sure they all need glass and I don't have very much of it. Uh, for example, the recyclers. Okay, I need three of those. That's not bad. Oh, electric waste. We can't get that one. So you know what? We'll do this one for now. Get this upgrade. Anything else we want to upgrade? Oh, we might as well buy that cat house, too. Ooh, what's this? Solar power station. Neat. Uh, over here, yeah, see, beehives need glass. Mayonnaise maker needs glass. Uh, the jam house upgrade needs glass. So, I'll get the, the jam house for now. Uh, I couldn't do the... Yeah, this one, could I? No, because I need the electric waste. Darn it, that's the one that I really want. So for now, I guess we can do the jam house with you folks. And in between episodes, I will try to 
uh, upgrade everything that I can with all the good stuff. So let's come over here. Let's see what this is going to take. Uh, no. Yes, please. Thank you. And seven. Put that on top of there. Let's go give ourselves a quick little sleep. Oof. Uh, after we put down the kitty house. Uh, kitty, 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 right here. Yeah, kitty can go over here. All right, so now we just have to tame a kitty next time we see it. And I'm not sure what exactly it needs. So let's get the sleep on so we can take a look at the, uh, what the two upgrades bring us. Okay, so... So this went from 10 before. I'm hoping it takes 20 now. Uh, let's go over here. Oh boy. I might not have enough. Oh, what am I doing? Ah, uh, I gotta preserve, not make preserves. Brain toot. Okay. That's the upgraded one? I wonder how many more it's going to give me then. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Let's see how much this takes. Oh yeah, it takes 2,000 per time. Nice. We're going to burn through these piles soon enough. I mean, we have a, we have a bit. But uh, yeah, 2,000 a crack. Sweet. All right, so that's where I'm going to end today's episode. Thank you so much for joining me. I look forward to jumping into Frozen Peaks in the next episode with you folks. Um, as always, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so very much to the members. Like I always say, I appreciate you guys so very, very much making it so I can reach the minimums every month. You guys are absolutely awesome and amazing. Enjoy the perks. Enjoy the uh, monthly member Mondays. And yeah, I'm... Uh, I think I'm almost done the demo week. I only have a couple more on there. Um, so, yeah, I don't think there was anything else that I wanted to mention to you folks at this time. Other than, thank you so very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for taking time to kick back, relax, unwind with me. No matter where you are in the world, whether it be morning, evening, afternoon, good night. I hope you and your friends, your family, and all those you take care of and love stay safe. And I'll see you in the next episode.